What do children really need in these troubling times? They need discipline, guidance, and love for the Lord. The insightful book, Without Souls, was written for today's younger generation, the children who haven't been raised in the same way the author was. In those days, many of us had our mothers and fathers at home, says Deacon Parton Lawton. They were disciplinarians back then. The children are different these days. They don't know the Lord, and it is up to us who lived through that time to tell our young. She adds that in her book, you will review vintage documents from one of the most self-governing spaces and times in all American history, laced with original signatures of some of the most revered men in all antiquity. Take, for example, President Theodore Roosevelt, who said, A thorough knowledge of the Bible is worth more than a college education. Or President Abraham Lincoln, I am profitably engaged in reading the Bible. Take all of this book upon reason that you can, and the balance of faith, and you will live and die a better man. It was President John Quincy Adams who said, my custom is to read four to five chapters of the Bible every morning immediately after rising. It seems to me the most suitable manner of beginning the day. It is an invaluable and inexhaustible mine of knowledge and virtue. The author says, we were special though because just about all of us knew God and went to church. Can you imagine? A young generation was in love with God. We need this today. Without Souls, Missing Children, The Gift from God is now available at Amazon.com and other online retailers, as well as directly from the publisher.